Hello! It's good friend Montrose Murkington III here. As you can see, we're in a bit of a new surroundings here. Uh, friend, uh, friend Matthew here has, has a, a legitimate man cave now. Uh, we're in this new place watching NXT in your house. Take over 2021. It's a bit of a lengthy title. I think they're calling them all in your house now. Okay. Except, like, I think they're doing, like, the big ones of the year will be, like, themed. Oh, all right. Because this is the second in your house one that they've done. Do you think they're going to keep paying for Todd Pettengill to come in? I hope they're not. Now, you have that weird soul patch thing going on on the front of his face. I don't even know if you can call that soul patch. Well, <laughs> when you're soulless, right? <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow. Um, so it, we, we started the night off with a, a six-man tag team, uh, MSK and Bronson Reed. Uh, actually, it made me think of like a millennial version of Brodus Clay and the Fuckadactyls. Um, but anyhow, uh, and they, they, they were taking on uh, the Gato del Fantasma, was that? Uh, Fantasma. Fantasma. I guess. Alright, there probably is a difference, so I won't say what's the difference. Uh, my goodness, the um, the train wreck. Well, not not, not in a bad way though. Like, it was like a decent six man tag. It was a, it was it was a good, but the the, 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 the facials a, from the <laughs> from the heels was awesome. Yes, uh, the gatos. Uh, they they uh, they had a. I feel they could have been on telenovelas with with the the, the facial expressions. Uh, Any time they took a really hard. Shot just the uh, well. I can't do it because uh, I don't have face muscles for it. Uh, but it, it was it was quite entertaining. It told the story very well. Uh, we also the uh, some of the high impact moves in in this match were were really quite something. Uh, Bronson Reed he broke through the barrier with the, the chain link fence, and I know, you know it's gimmicked, but still, you know it, it is rather impressive to watch. Uh, he, he did a suicide dive, which I was really quite impressed with. Uh, and the, but the big thing was he, he climbed to the top rope at the end of it. Big splash. That's, that's, what, that's what ended the whole thing. So, um, I, don't, I, you know, I, I don't know really There's any of them. TV what? with a VHS built into it. See, that's what he's trying to do. That's the joke here. He's old. Yeah. See? <laughs> Anyhow, uh, that was the big wing move, and I was quite quite impressed. Uh, lots of fast-paced lucha-style action, uh, very good, and it was really interesting to have the um, you know the the Bronson Reed in as just something a little different because he's so much uh, larger than, than everybody else who's in the in the match. Uh, gonna keep going, watching. Uh, to be good, we're checking out some May Young stuff here that uh, Todd Pettengill tried to show on a VHS tape. Uh, so take that for what it's worth. Thank you! More later!